start with the red card, please. Awesome. Sorry? Could you start with your thoughts on the red card, please. I uh, think it was quick and harsh, but I have to watch it again. You haven't watched it again? No. What can I change if it doesn't change anything now? I uh, believe that uh, uh, the referee made a decision and we had to get on with it. It looks like I said he didn't touch him or why is it harsh? I didn't speak to Perma of the soccer. But just your initial thought was that it wasn't, there wasn't contact with somebody. Look, you, uh, we have 25 or 35 journalists here. I'm sure you have all seen it again and analyzed it, and you know much more about that situation than I do. I, I cannot comment it because at this time uh, I didn't know was uh, Costa offside or not, and uh, did it perm or to suck a touch him or not? I don't know. Yeah. It was, of course, uh, frustrating, but it is a decision we had to to get on the chin and get on with our job, and that's what we did. I think uh, the team after that focused, uh, was resilient, uh, did fight until the last second, and uh, despite the disappointing result, we should come even more believe in ourselves today after the game, when I see the game, uh, uh, how things went. The fans weren't happy with the Giroud substitution. Sorry? The, the, the fans weren't happy with the Giroud substitution. They blew yeah, but uh, what, what do you, uh, I don't understand your question. Well, they were booing the. Uh, do you want to make a poll uh, after for every decision to see who uh, does what? I made the decision, and for me it was uh, quite a, no, a normal decision. Did you say because we had to go from long distances, and we needed pace to go from one goal to the other, and that uh, uh, we knew we had to drop deeper and uh, to use pace to get forward. Could you say in another interview also that Costa got the second sent off? You want me to say things I, I'm not interested in, you know. Uh, yeah. I'm asking if you said, there's a, hmm? some quotes from an earlier interview you seem to have done saying Costa got Who? the second sent off. I said Gost, Costa got two of our players sent off in the last two games against Chelsea without uh, that are only facts. Is it right or was the decision right or wrong? I don't know, but uh, that is a fact. Uh, without accusing him of anything. I was going to ask about the, um, the captaincy before the game. Was that, was that a planned event for Perman Saka to give the arm man to feel? Yes, uh, yes. Was it in any way a distraction to your team? Before such a big picture today, no? no, I think, uh, no, uh, pff, you know, you can find uh, many reasons, but you never really know. Uh, I felt that uh, we are frustrated after the game because we, we didn't, couldn't play the game with our, our real assets, and uh, that is frustrating. I don't think that is really down to the fact that Walcott, uh, that Murta Saki gave a captaincy to Walcott. Awesome. Was Giroud fully fit? Was Giroud fully fit? Giroud? Yeah. I think yes, but it was a bit in my mind, you know, that if he gets injured uh, uh, as well, for his ankle, was a doubt. He didn't practice yesterday. Today, this morning, we declared him fit. Of course, it was in my, on my mind. But uh, uh, I had to change a player. I, had, I, uh, I thought that was the most rational decision with all the, the, the factors were included in that decision. What about is there a Sanchez? Happy with, I was going to say, were you happy with Sanchez's performance at least like gave Yeah, he came on uh, quite well. It took him a while to get in the game, but in the last 20 minutes uh, he uh, was sharp. Well, so why do you think your recent record is so poor against Chelsea specifically? I think today was a special game, you know, uh, uh, we played with 10 men, we were 1-0 down straight away. Normally uh, you lose a game like that 3-4-0. When you have to chase a game, nothing more dangerous than being down to 10 men overall. We come out with a lot of regret because we feel uh, we couldn't play with our team. And uh, looking at Chelsea today, I think there was a lot of room to beat them if we had played with 11 players. Oh, so there's an explanation. 
Is there an explanation for your poor disciplinary record against Chelsea? That's four red cards in five games. Is it the way they play? Is it something about how hyped up your players are? Or how do you explain it? I would uh, not compare today's situation. Uh, it's not a confrontational situation like it was at Chelsea. It was a, a fact of a game, you know, and the decision of the referee. I don't think that uh, it was linked with any uh, bad behaviour or attitude.